Hello there informed beauties, welcome back to the channel, welcome back to another video. Tonight's video we are going to be talking about some fall fragrances, or we're going to talk about one particular fall fragrance that I have really been enjoying. It is a new one to my collection and walking into fall and into winter I am definitely going to be sharing a little bit more of my fragrance collection with you guys so just stay tuned but this one here I think is perfect because this is a great starter for anyone who is wanting to jump into starting their perfume collection or is looking for something new to add to their perfume collection I think this one is a great one to start with it is under a hundred dollars and it is also a great gift idea Christmas is coming up for a loved one who loves gourmand perfumes. If you are new here, hello, my name is Eunice Marie, and here we talk about all things skincare, acne skincare particularly. We do get ready with me, a little bit of lifestyle talk, so make sure you go ahead and take a moment to subscribe. for a new fall perfume that I can throw into my collection. I am a gourmand, I am a vanilla girl, I am a coconut, almond, cashmere, tonka, bourbon. I am a girl who loves the deep gourmands or the gourmands, period. So when I saw the hype around this perfume, I said, okay, let me step into Ulta and see what all the hype is about. Immediately when I saw that it was for $42, I was like, all right, 42, mm, let's see what that's really about. So sprayed it onto the tester, smelled it, and immediately off the back, that's all me. That is all me in a bottle, okay? The perfume that we are going to be talking about today is the Fresh Cream Warm Cashmere by Philosophy. Now, I will tell you, there are two types of this perfume. You have the Fresh Cream, and you also have the Fresh Cream Warm Cashmere. I took a look at the Fresh Cream, which I did not like at all. It's too milky for me, but this right here with the Warm Cashmere, perfection. This here is a two fluid ounce and it retailed for $42. They do have one that I think that is a 1.7 fluid ounce and it's about 20 bucks. Let's talk about the wear on this. Let's talk about the notes. Let's talk about just my experience. Let's just get into it all. The notes on this fragrance, what to expect, um, and what family this is in and everything before you even decide if this is even for you. So this is in the fragrance uh, family of Woody. The scent type is a Woody Gourmand. The top note is a Juicy Tangerine. The middle note is a Cashmere Wood and Orchid. And the base note is a Vanilla Bean, Creamy Sandalwood, and the uh, Skin Musk. If you are not familiar with the top, middle, and the base, I'm going to break it down real quick. The top note is the first thing you smell. When you spray it, that is the first scent you get, okay? The middle note is, I believe, sometime into the fragrance. As it kind of dies down, you get the second note, okay? And then the base note is the last note, the one that sticks around the longest. is the one that you smell, okay? So when I personally am looking for a perfume, and I like vanilla, gourmands, tonkas, all that, I specifically look for a base note that is a vanilla, a woody, a tonka, so that I know that I'm going to be getting the projection of vanilla. I definitely don't smell the juicy tangerine in this. I don't know where they get juicy tangerine from because I probably get a, a little bit of it in the top note, but nothing too much. I definitely pick up on that cashmere, the wood. Um, I definitely get the skin must. So this does have a great spray on it. It sprays pretty finely. It has a nice um, mist to it and it just smells amazing. This is a very light weight perfume. This is your everyday type of perfume. And I wanna let you know, this is a Oude Toilette. So this is a lighter perfume. It's not gonna last as long or have a great projection like a, um, a Oude Parfum. Those are a little bit more you know, stronger. These toilettes, they are a lighter, uh, they are a lighter fragrance, a lighter projection. 
this is more of a cozy scent when you spray this on this is a more cozy scent you're gonna smell this when somebody is up close to you it's a very inviting warm like scent like when i spray this on me and i wear it i get like a very intimate cozy cabin light a candle lay in bed cuddle up with a cashmere blanket that's what i get from from when i from when i wear this and it is just a beautiful beautiful just fragrance and this is great to layer over anything else that is a vanilla body butter body lotion it is great to pair with vanilla oil it's a great layering piece this does not last long on the skin i will say for this you'll have to reapply but layering it with other vanillas um that does help but this is a type where you're not i can spray this all over my body spray 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 it and then like a couple of hours in, I feel like I don't smell it as much. Like my chest, my stomach area, like more here, I can smell it more. But if you're talking about like the neck or more exposed areas, I feel like it kind of, you know, goes away on those areas quicker. Like if you just are looking for something for the fall that is not too much, that is not too heavy, something that you just want to try and throw into your everyday routine, I think this is a great way to go. It is a very beautiful beautiful fragrance and I definitely have already put a nice little dent into this and I definitely need to go get another bottle already <laughs> but um, it just goes to show that it is a very beautiful great fragrance so I will leave all links down below for you guys to go and check this out go into your nearest Ulta spray it smell it figure out if it's for you it's a great perfume for anyone who is into the gourmand family like me and you like a true vanilla a true gourmand scent this is it okay because you if you are into the gourmand scents and the vanillas you know there are some out there that just they just smell synthetic they don't smell good they smell syrupy and that is not what you want you want to smell like a snack okay you want to smell delicious and this is exactly what it's going to do. I definitely will leave links down below for you to go ahead and get your hands on this philosophy and check them out. But I definitely recommend going in store and giving them a sniff. I definitely believe that if you are a gourmand person or you are shopping for a gourmand loved one, they are going to love this, okay? And that being said, you guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to rate, comment, subscribe, all that fun stuff. And I will see you guys in a later video. Bye. As well at the end.